Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to uh, Minecraft LAN Party, kind of. Not really. Uh, I am in the Minecraft LAN Party world, but I have relocated it to a test server because I wanted to see what did the new stable version of the Spigot 1.14 build looked like in the world. So, I just logged in now. We are in 1.13.2. Somebody just uh, triggered. And uh, so I'm going to go log out, shut down the server, upgrade it to 1.14, cross my fingers, log back in. I just wanted to see where I was in the world in this backup. So I will be right back. Okay, so here we are on the launcher. I can switch over to latest release 1.14.4. So this is a stable version of Spigot 1.14.4. I noticed it a few days ago. Uh, I don't know how old it actually is. Hi, Clancy. That's my dog, Clancy. And here we are loading Minecraft 1.14 by 0.4 for the first time on this computer. <laughs> Um, oh, and let us go full screen. All right, so they've already started releasing snapshots. Can't connect to server. Oh, <laughs> hang on a second. It helps if the server is actually running. Let's try that again. Thanks for joining the game. Okay, here we are. <gasps> wow. Why you why do you say it now? That's really weird. Oh, he has a profession. Does it convert all the villagers into nitwits? Or the uh, unemployed equivalent? Oh, Mr. Fletcher has a profession. <gasps> oh, wow. One potato. Okay, so. Interesting. So I've got a bunch of villagers here um, that don't have professions or appear not to have professions. That's okay. I don't mind. Um, what about this guy over here that I captured? Uh, David F. Pumpkins is still okay. Baby Huey is okay. Uh, he looks like a farmer. Okay. And Baby Huey is still here and name tagged. All right. So we're going to go. Uh, I'm not going to like do anything insane like uh, fishermen. Oh, okay. So, I want to go over, primarily I wanted to do this to go over to the pyramid and see how my villagers over there are doing. Um, I may have to do some work to convert them into farmers because I may have grabbed Fletchers and... I may have grabbed Fletchers and fishermen, other... Other brown coats who are able to farm for some reason. Okay, uh, so let's go over there. So we can peek by a few things like the uh, the Wither, uh, the Nether Fortress, Wither Fortress, whatever this thing is called. Um, I don't see anybody in there. Oh, I should eat. And. There's a blaze. There's a couple of blazes. Oh. oh and he's gotten upset at me. Hello, Mr. Wither Skeletons. Oh, huh. Did they change their range of their aggro range? Recipes unlocked. Oh, I can now make a campfire. Uh, wow. 
Oh, goodness. Huh. Hmm. Okay, I don't really need these guys. I just wanted to see if maybe I got a wither skeleton head. Uh, let's see if they change this a little bit. Oh, they fixed it. Yay. Okay. Um, yeah, so... Oh, okay. The spawning in the fortress here now definitely is back to what it should be. Oh, I got withered. Uh, eat. Huh. Okay. This is very good news. You'd be able to come in here and actually hunt with their skeletons again. Okay, but this is a side. This is a this is a distraction. Let's go over to the pyramid. So that's very exciting. And we can actually use the fortress. Whoa, the spawning in the nether seems to have gone crazy. Okay. <laughs> Uh, now it may be that I, I I slapped an awful lot of this, so there's not a lot of spawning opportunities in this area, but there is a bunch over here. I mean, look at this. This is crazy. Okay, onward to the pyramid. Uh, I should test my rail systems to make sure that they still work. Let's go into the pyramid. Loading terrain very slowly. Ah, that's interesting. I was facing the side of the portal when I walked through. That's uh, definitely not normal behavior. Okay, so I've got these guys. These are all clean villagers with no inventory and a couple of them are farmers a couple are not okay and these nitwit guys are still nitwits so my thought was I could use these guys to build a, a breeder they should be able to breed and they don't need sky access anymore which is kind of cool uh, this guy is nothing and this guy. So these two should be empty, devoid of uh, potatoes and such. Um, he's also nothing. Okay, so my thinking is I want to go over and check out the guys in the, uh, the, the potato farm. Concern is... That they have all, or some of them, have at least lost their professions. Um, let's do it like this. I probably should be in creative mode for this. Oops. Ah. Okay. So now, put this up here. Put this down here. Huh. Okay. Hi, dude. 
So one one thought I had was like this um You can hear the mine cards even though they're stuck and they're not going anywhere. Okay, so my thought was this here doesn't really do any good. So we can say, give me a composter. And we put a composter right there. Oh, ah, interesting. So, if within sufficient rain, range of this composter, dude should be able to um, decide he's a farmer. And it may be that in the corners, he's too far away from the composter to decide, oh, hey, I'm a farmer. <laughs> yeah, see, he's... he's uh... Okay, so what I want to do here is put in a piston here. I just happen to have a piston. And. And get a red. Oh, lever will work, right? I think. Can I put a lever right on the side of the piston? It does. Oh, interesting. And then I can put another. I should just give myself some regular blocks. Okay, and then I should be able to take a piece. Oh, look, he's a farmer now. Um, and then I should be able to take a piece of carpet blop, and put it over the composter, right? Dude is a farmer and he's retaining farmer status. So he should be able to go actually farm, right? Yes, yeah, I can even trade with him. And trading with him might actually be a really smart thing, right? Because... Potatoes. He is farming potato. No, th these are... These are potatoes. So I can give myself some potatoes. Oops. Let's uh, move these up here. Give myself some potato. And then, uh, plop. this up here, plop. and once you trade with them, they retain the, um, they retain, retain the profession, even if the workbench goes away, even if their workstation goes away, they continue to be farmers. Ah, oh. hi, dude. Are you going to start actually farming? Because there's like, there's spots here where there's nothing that need planting. And there's fully grown potatoes all over the place. Huh. Creepy sound. Oh, what time of day is it? That might have... That might play into things. Because it may not be his work time yet. Um... Oh, he just farmed. Yay, okay. I'm feeling, uh... I'm feeling kind of good about this. All right, so now let's go visit this guy. He already thinks he's a farmer. Now, I don't need to trade with them. I don't need them to refresh their trades. Oh, I've traded with him. Okay.
But without a without a workstation, maybe he won't. So I don't think he'll use that one up there. Maybe without a workstation, he won't feel that he needs to trade. Hi. Are you going to do some farming? Hey, buddy. Sorry about the dog bark. Okay, so this is a little bit of a cramped quarters, but... Um, huh. Okay, I will have to figure out a procedure to get... Get this guy down here. Oh, you know what? I may not need that. Oh, I can just do it like that, right? There we go. So now he has a workstation. You're in your work period. Oh. Did you just get stuck now? Oh, good. He's farming. Oh, Bowser's barking because the gardeners are here. Okay. Things might get a little noisy. Uh, I apologize. We're just doing testing, so... Uh, this guy's a farmer. So, anybody that I traded with as a farmer ahead of time retains the farmer status. And will they do farming on their own? It's going to get noisy. Sorry about that, but... <laughs> okay, I'm feeling optim... I'm feeling a little optimistic about this. Um, so. Composter. Now this guy... He's a fisherman, but he's... Uh-oh. Okay, interesting. Okay, so I've he's a fisherman. I traded with him perhaps as a fisherman. That would be really dumb if I did, but oh, that's weird. He's got he's got like the farmer outfit though, doesn't he? I don't know. Will he farm? If not, I may have to figure out a way of getting new farmer villagers down in here. And it, assuming I do, oops, I'm gonna get a uh, villager spawn egg here, and that. and if I if I do this, I don't see you farming. Uh, so if I put a new villager in here. Ah, now he's a farmer. Okay. So, yeah, I may have to do that. And what time of day is it? It's still... You should still be able to do work, right? You should be able to harvest up some of these potatoes. Farmer, novice. Um, sure, let's give you one of these. Okay. Now you're stuck as a farmer? Oh, his, his outfit changed a little bit. You can start farming, dude. There's all these potatoes here for you.
a few a few non-farmer villager types in there. A couple fishermen that I need to do something with. I probably need to replace them, unfortunately. Because they seem to be locked into their fisherman status. And then, um... Everyone's farming, though. That's good. Let's go check to make sure that my shulker box loader works under 1.14. Because that would suck if it did not. So we're loading up. Uh-oh. Oh, I just destroyed. Darn it. Okay, so let's do this. <clears throat> Um, should go back into survival. I mean, the choker box didn't get trapped in there somewhere, did it? Let's go make sure. Oh, this one was partial. Okay. Um, so what we can do, well, I keep hitting that K. All right. Um, so what I want to do is I want to load this guy up. It'll do its thing. Okay. Because there's probably plenty of potatoes stuck back here. Yeah, there are. Okay. So, let's do this. And observe. Yep. Nice. Very nice. Twenty-two more. Whoa. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Very good. I'm gonna destroy this shulker box. All right, that's good. So the farmers will work. Um, having all these guys up here ahead of time means I have an opportunity to convert them into what I want before I put them down in the farm, right? So, yeah. farmer, farmer. Fisherman, I will need to fix you. Fisherman, okay. All right. Uh, oh, let's go check out the other farms. Uh, so, sugarcane farm should still all behave the same. Ah, it's like I forgot how to type. Yep. Okay. Squid Farm is probably still completely inactive. Um. Whoa, how did that happen? Okay, so that's still going. Have to double check the collection, but, and then, all my sheep are still here. Yeah. Um, and then let's check in on the slimes. Is this still a slime chunk? I see some little baby slimes down there. I see some medium slime. Okay. Slime farm still working. Uh, hello, Mr. Zombie Pigman. Did I kill him? Um, interesting. Did I kill him or did, was that the same guy? We dropped a gold nugget. Um, interesting. 
Or is that another zombie pigman spawn? The other thing I need to test, but I won't do that right now, is... If I... Make it so these guys can actually get into here, and there are beds, and there are... Workstations? Can I turn this into a village inside the pyramid? Because that was always kind of what I wanted. Um, so, like, if I put a bed up in here... Be cramped, but can a villager... So if I let loose a villager just inside the village here... Will he just claim that as a home? Um, I don't want too many villagers, but I don't need I don't need raids happening inside the pyramid. I don't know. I have to look into what the rules are on the raids. Like, do they need sky access to spawn? I don't know. There's nothing in there. Okay. Um, okay, so the gold nugget from that dude reminded me that I should check the gold farm. Let's go do that.